This is Berlin calling. And I'd just like to say that when Berlin calls, it pays to listen. And now a page from our Sunday morning almanac. May 6th, 1945, 67 years ago today. The day a radio announcer Americans called Axis Sally made her last propaganda broadcast on behalf of Germany just two days before Germany surrendered. At the sound of the gong, it was exactly nine o'clock Eastern War Time. Sally's real name was Mildred Gillers. Born and raised in Maine, Gillers acted in productions at Ohio Wesleyan University and was an occasional Broadway actress in the 20s before seeking her fortune overseas, first in France and then in Germany. While most Americans fled that nation at the start of World War II, Mildred Giller stayed on and became the Nazi shortwave English language voice. Good evening, women of America. Well, you know, as time goes on, I think of you more and more. I can't somehow seem to get you out of, your, out of my head. You women in America, waiting for the one you love, waiting and weeping in the secrecy of your own room, thinking of the husband, the son, or the brother, who is being sacrificed by Franklin D. Roosevelt, perishing on the fringes of Europe. Arrested and returned to the United States after the war, Gillars was convicted of treason in 1949 and sentenced to prison. She was unapologetic about her broadcast, saying she was a pawn of the Nazis and of her fiancé, a German Foreign Service officer. And in a moment, Axis Sally will come through the main gate. Paroled in 1961, she returned to Ohio, where she would live out her life as a kindergarten music teacher. <laughs> 